one of the things that I found rather odd about public radio is that it's very asexual. You know, this like politics, like religion, like social issues, sex is one of the real hot button issues. It's interesting to talk about, it's fun. And there's no reason you can't have serious, interesting conversations about sex the same way you would about science, the same way you would about healthcare, the same way you would about politics. And, and so very early on in Air Talk, it's, it's one of the things that we put into our whole palette of the program. Let me just tell you a little bit about my background, because that probably plays into it. Uh, uh, I was uh, raised by teenagers, essentially. You know, my parents were teenagers. So I, I grew up in an environment where, um, you know, they talked about their appreciation for each other. They, you know, they kissed very openly. They were very... So I was sort of, from a young age, exposed to, you know, passion in a relationship. And then my grandfather was a doctor and who did sex education for different um, teens organizations and the like. So we'd sit down at my grandparents and, you know, have some conversation about uh, homosexuality or about, you know, sexual activity. And there were no taboo at all because he very much, you know, lived in this world, believed in free access to information. Since he was a church elder, and, and a very uh, devout Christian who believed in openness about talking about sex. And so I grew up in an environment where it was just another topic. It was just like anything else. There's nothing really different about the category of sex. It's, it's a you know, basic part of human life and something we should be able to talk about in a variety of different ways, from the humorous to the light to the, to the serious, because it is important. And so I hope that that straightforward approach connects with listeners. I do get some complaints about it for people who feel that, that it is by definition trivial. And I have a hard time with that because I don't know how anyone could think sex is trivial.